Good evening. A Sumatran tiger has attacked an animal keeper at Australia Zoo, biting and puncturing his leg. The man was taken to hospital. It's the second such attack in eight months. This is 10-year-old Juma, a 130-kilogram Sumatran tiger, described by Australia Zoo as laid back. And although bred in captivity, spending most of his life on the Sunshine Coast, this morning something set him off, turning on an experienced handler, someone he's known for years. It's just a, a puncture wound to the leg and just doing during your routine stuff. The zoo announced the incident via Twitter saying one of its handlers had been, quote, tagged by a tiger. I certainly wouldn't say it was life-threatening and serious. That handler, believed to be 48-year-old Mark Turner, is now recovering in Nambour Hospital. He had to go get some medical treatment. He was talking and happy and whatever. There's no footage of the incident as it happened away from the Tiger Temple. That wasn't the case in November last year when handler David Stiles was attacked by a 114 kilogram Bengal Tiger Charlie during a live show in front of shock tourists. He's got to get out while he's bleeding. He suffered damage to his neck and shoulder and needed several surgeries. Another less serious incident was reported a month later. Ironically, today was International Tiger Day. The endangered big cats celebrated around the world, including one who appears to have got a little too excited. It's one of those things, I think. Reporter Alex Bernhardt is live outside Australia Zoo. Alex, how's the handler doing? Well, we understand, Melissa, that Mark is in a stable condition in Nambour Hospital with his family by his side as we speak. And he did have emergency surgery this afternoon on that leg wound. But obviously, this is far from the kind of publicity that Australia Zoo would be after on World Tiger Day. Melissa? All right, Alex, thank you.